my home that I live in now, uh, some of my priorities ha had shifted a little bit from, from when I was younger. I was looking for something with a little bit more space, uh, but was still close to downtown. Um, I wanted something that could get me to the beach within a couple minutes, but I, I, I wanted something where I could, when I went home, I felt like I was away from the office and, uh, and gave, me, gave me enough distance that uh, just, just time to relax really and enjoy myself when I was there. The, uh, the home itself is, uh, it's got a nice big backyard, it's close to all the elementary schools, and uh, and it's a five minute walk for me to get to the YMCA and that to me uh, saves me a ton of time and, and just really really provides me with uh, with a sense of home when I'm there uh, as opposed to uh, as opposed to when I used to live downtown and there was so much going on. Once you've decided to sell your home and you understand your motivation for selling, the important thing is going to be to understand the process that we're going to go through to sell your home. You need to understand the details, the everyday aspects of selling, setting up of showings, the staging, the cleaning. There, are, there is going to be work involved, but it's something that I can help you manage and that we can work through together. Communication is really important. We're going to have showings, we're going to have lots of feedback. And it's really important for me and you to get together and be able to talk about how things are going, what the market's doing, and how we can adjust to the market if we need to. My job and what I really try and do is protect you from some of those complications and make it as enjoyable a process as possible. I want to help you have a good experience when you're selling your home. Once you've decided to sell your home, we need to understand that there's a process involved. It's not something that's gonna happen overnight. We've gotta prepare, and you've gotta be prepared to have a little bit of patience. Just because your cousin's cousin sold their house in two days doesn't mean it's gonna happen for us. We need to take into account that there's gonna be some bumps in the road. We're gonna to need to do a little bit of shuffling here and there, but together we can make it a smooth process and we can make it work for you. We can make it a situation where 10 years from now you look back and you think, I really enjoyed selling my home. <laughs>